And my name is Void Puppet, and welcome back to my playthrough of Resident Evil 4. It's been a month since I last played this, but I'm going to suffer through it anyway. It's probably going to be a short one today, uh, just because I don't have that much time. Um, but I'm going to get through this section at least. This is the garden that Salazar was talking about. I'm not ready for this. So, I gotta trudge through the garden. little uh, touch there. So this garden is a simple maze garden, nothing oh, too fancy, but it's going to be enough to disorient me. There's a treasure uh, on the back wall there, but the key that I need is from those two uh, circles. So I'm going to have to try and survive through this little ordeal. The pets that he's talking about are <laughs> The very same things that killed me my very first uh, death. I don't need money. I don't need loot. Doggies. The growls are going to be constant. It looks like I can go left or right, but I may need to go left. So they're not going to open just yet until I get through. Gosh, that's nerve-wracking. they'll be able to break in on their own, or break out on their own, but I'd rather just not take that chance. I'll definitely take that, goodness. The treasure is down there, but I have to reach it from the other side. Let me pick up the moon first, and then I'll be on my way there anyway.
Yeah, today's gonna be a short stream, nothing uh, too severe. Oh, is this a dead end? It's a dead end. Sadness. I'm probably going to stop either by this save point right after meeting the friend, or by this save point. Depending on how fast I can get through all this, I'm not too confident. Okay, that's where the dogs are. I'm not going to touch that. Wrong button. I'm actually collecting some healing items now, which is good. Money is not too important right now. Up to the right. Here's the treasure. The red gem. I believe that'll complete them. The first mask I got. Yep. So I can sell this one for its full value, but I only got one for this and one for that. Not going to be a perfect set. But that's alright. the right half of the moonstone. Hello, hello. Hope you guys are doing okay. Hope everything sounds okay. Goodness. I'm still a little sniffly just because uh, I cannot seem to take care of myself. Got a high vantage point. Let's see. Well... It looks like I need to go in that direction to go over this bridge to get to uh, the other moons, moonstone half. So, don't mind if I do. Ah, two for one, but one got away. The panic. but I can't tell. Uh, going in the right direction. There is a treasure chest right there, but that's also an ambush. I'm gonna go for it. I will take that. Oh, sorry about that. Ah, get off me, get off me. Alarm. Let's 
side. There's another chest right over there. Go for it. More ammo is worth. So now I gotta make my way back up to the uh, door here. So it's gonna be a bit of a walk. Ah! What a mess! I was expecting the ambush, but I needed to cross that threshold. That sucks. Thankfully, I can just jump right down here. Sucks not having that much ammo. Alrighty. The blue moonstone. A blue stone with a crescent engraving. Ah, it's beautiful. opened and I have my first save point here. Put your hands where I can see them. Sorry, but following a lady's lead just isn't my style. Put them up now. Pair of glasses. Ada. <laughs> I'm not going to save it here because there's literally a save point right over there. Or typewriter right there. Yes, more handgun ammo, please. Spino Merchant. The mirror with pearls and rubies. That is beautiful. Female intruder. 
There seems to be a female intruder among us. We believe she's connected with Sarah. We also believe that she was the one who removed the egg injected into Sarah before it hatched. She may have had him retrieve the sample before the American agent arrival. It's obvious that her objective is the sample. We must get to her before she's able to re-establish contact with Sarah. There's also reason to believe that she's working for somebody. We need her alive for interrogation. The female should be able to answer all our questions. After we have captured her, Sarah will no longer be of any concern. As long as we retrieve the sample, you may dispose of him as you see fit. Oof. Messy. Okay, I have a good assortment of items here. I'll just use uh, just a regular green herb to heal up. Welcome. Got some rare things on sale, stranger. I was gonna what say I can't buying? really buy much except for upgrades, so I'm just gonna have to go for that. This is another weapon I could use. It's just uh, not very practical at this time. Well, let's see. What are you saying? Five spino. <laughs> three is velvet that blue. <laughs> Thank you. The elegant mask with all three gems. Ah, I'll buy it at a high price. <laughs> Thank you. The mirror with pearls and rubies. Ah, I'll buy it at a high price. <laughs> Thank you. I'll be able to complete this one a little bit later. This one, I'm not too confident about, but I'll hang on to it until I uh, finish the castle level, or castle area. What are you buying? Oof. Come back any time. I guess, first things first, let me get the mine thrower. I'm gonna need another weapon uh, to help with this. Not only will you need cash, but you'll need guts to buy that weapon. <laughs> only one thing of firing speed. I can only get one upgrade of reload, a little bit more power, and a little bit more capacity. It's gonna be hefty, but it will be doable. <laughs> Thank you. The scope. Is that all strength? <laughs> Thank you. What are you buying? Alright, let's check out upgrades. Definitely got a few that I can use here. Is that all, stranger? <laughs> Thank you. Is that all, stranger? <laughs> Thank you. Not enough cash, stranger. Oof. Is that all, stranger? <laughs> Thank you. I think I have a lot of money and it's still not enough. <laughs> what are you buying? Because I have a lot of healing items, he's not gonna sell any first aid spray. That's perfectly fine. Okay. My items are pretty stacked right now. Um my case is getting nearly full. But I shouldn't be too confident because this is gonna be a lot. So we completed the garden section, video over. <laughs> no, not just yet. Um, since I still have time, I should be able to get to at least this section right before uh, we rescue Ashley. Um, so, it's a small room. I am not confident in what that room is. Let me save it first, and we continue on. We're nearly catching up to my original file. I 
I doubt we're going to get that far around the same time. Do I have... I have incendiary grenades, but no flash grenades. I could easily die in this section. It just depends if I goof or not on a certain aspect. So let me collect everything I can. That's locked. Real simple target just that I miss. Oh, please don't do me like this. <laughs> I don't know how I missed that up two times. Goodness. So if I remember right, that should be a key for this area right here. But I have something more pressing to deal with. A claw guy right here. Worth it. Yeah, that's about what I expected. All because I don't have a single flash grenade to really make this count. Okay, so the only way I can get through this with the setup that I have right now is if I can blast out the door. Because regardless if I intend to go for that item or not, it's going to trap me in regardless. So I have to set up the grenade first while we have space then blast away with the mine thrower because apparently I was not doing nearly enough damage to deal with this confined space and I really hate this section not sure that flash grenade's gonna do me much good but I gotta give it a try Gone. <laughs> uh, 
I need a breather from that. I could go back for that uh, hourglass thing. I'm just not sure it's worth. <sighs> By using the hand grenade to... Uh, To open up the door, I made it easier for myself to deal with that. The only issue is, when I do spring Ashley, this room would be inaccessible afterwards. Because I would have to fight through this guy in order to get back here, or carry Ashley throughout all this mess to get back up to this treasure chest here because I want to get this chest with Ashley and I need Ashley to do so. So he'll still be alive in there or I can try to kill him now that I've opened the door but for now I'm just gonna leave it be because I have something else to deal with here. I have a full set of crap. Oh my god, why is that sway? That's the spider one. That is the least threatening. much prefer the spider infected over the scythe one or the or the uh, leech one the bridge is open or lifted point blank with <laughs> only I would miss point blank with a shotgun I could go straight ahead to the next area here, but there's some more interesting stuff in this direction. Oh, he's got a helmet.
creepy music done, that is the end of combat. Boink. So, that is right, there is an assortment of goodies right here. From ammo to a fecking rocket launcher. How am I going to equip this thing with all this on my arsenal here? It's going to be about the same size as the shotgun, so I have to consider my options here. Maybe I shouldn't have gotten the mine thrower just yet. <sighs> uh, having to play Tetris here is going to be a nuisance. But that's okay. I can only imagine that I would be. You're on the phone? Oh, you're playing? Oh, uh, sorry. I was gonna show you something. Apologies for that. Uh, it would be difficult to try to get this rocket launcher right now, but as long as I don't touch the case, it should be fine. However,. Given my assortment of items, I don't think I'll be able to get it, no matter what I do. So, me playing Tetris with some items is going to have to be a bit of a mini-game here. Da -da -da. Close, but no cigar. Okay, so I have a decent assortment of items here to be considered. I could use some of the ammo to just go ham on the claw guy, but as long as I leave this case alone, it won't matter. So let's head back and continue on for the moment, because this will still be right here. It's special loot that's not going to vanish upon, um, unless I open it, it should be okay. There's a merchant right there anyway, so maybe I, I can sell some stuff or get an idea of how much the rocket launcher is for space. Because I'm gonna need that rocket launcher. Like, no question about it. Got some rare things on sale, stranger. What are you buying? Dang it. <laughs> What are you uh, selling? To get that case right now is just cruel and unusual. Is that all? <laughs> is that all? <laughs> Thank you. Ah, I'll buy it at a high price. <laughs> Still only about Thank halfway you. through. The mine door isn't even worth that much. What are you buying? But I have enough to at least buy the rocket launcher. Stranger. Ranger, now that's a weapon. So th it's the exact same size as the shotgun in terms of space. So, despite what I have here, I need to kill off that four by two square right there in order to make this work. So I do have an idea. What are you selling? Is that all, stranger? <laughs> I don't need the scope Thank right you. now. Uh, 
Okay. So close. So I just have to forfeit one of the uh, incendiary grenades and then I got it. Okay. I, I can do that. And let me just sell it to him instead of wasting it. What are you selling? Is that all strength? <laughs> just a little bit of money. I wish I could have gotten that case beforehand instead of buying all the upgrades because that would have been helpful, but that's my mistake. Everything else comes after the... up the, uh, by picking up the shotgun ammo, I screwed myself on space, but now I should be okay. Oh. Wait. Excellent. No, I don't want the flash grenade. Give me the handgun ammo. There we go. So all that's left here is the two grenades, which I'm okay without. There is a reason why they give you the rocket launcher um, for free, instead of having to pay the 30,000 bitas in order to uh, buy the damn thing. Because there's going to be a very heavy encounter later on in the level that you're going to want to keep this damn thing for. And even I had that feeling when I first played this to have it in case I needed it. I thought I was going to need it for like a final boss in this level or something, but nope, it's something almost just as bad. So, selling the one grenade and getting rid of the scope for now was definitely the best move in order to keep my stuff. I have a space for an egg, but an egg does not help me here. So, considering I have a lot of TMP ammo, that's what I'm going to go with right now. I don't think I want to get anything here. Uh, let me see. So, this is going to be a little bit of a fight, but I should be able to take care of it. Let me just double check one thing. Ah, yes. Okay. So, let me save it right now. And get this in. Leon, I got it. Lewis. Lewis. Oh. I have the sample. You serve me no purpose. Sadler! My boy Salazar will make sure you follow the same fate. Stay with me, Lois. I am a researcher hired by Sadler. He found out what I was up to. <laughs> Don't talk. Here. It should suppress growth of the parasite. The sample. Sadler took it. You have to get it back. Lewis! 
Lewis! Lewis! Unfortunately, um, getting impaled and then dropped hard like that, no one's gonna survive that. End of chapter 3-3. I just saved earlier. They'll pay for your death, I promise. Okay, so... We now reach the point where Ashley was captured and flipped around to the other side. Boxes are kind of weird, but I just want to make sure that this was secured. Talk about near-death experience. Ashley, get out of there! Okay, time to play defender. It's honestly good that they get close to her, so that way she can stay within an easy line of sight. Thankfully, I don't think any of them mutate, but some of them are going to have helmets. And also, thankfully... No one's going to ambush me up here. She's going to go find a door. God damn it. <laughs> uh, me and my damn aiming. <laughs> Alright, let's redo that. <laughs> I should have seen that coming. I cannot aim for crap. <laughs> Alright, let's do this again. I wanted to do this to be the last event that I do before stopping today. Out that uh, during the second phase of this little encounter or this little uh, defense, that Ashley would run back to the center, or I'd have a better eye on her. So she's gonna run over to the door. Reinforcements come from both sides, but mostly from this one. The door's locked. I can't open it.
This is the one and only uh, Ashley section that'll be in the game, where you can control her completely by your lonesome. No reason to really go out there, I think. I think it's going to stop her. I don't want to go back this way. Completely fair. <laughs> so she has the base briefcase uh, item uh, space here. No money. She has half the full health bar, like Cleon started with. This is where I'm going to call uh, it for today's stream. I want to thank you for stopping by and listening in. We're going to continue with the Ashley section and uh, try to make our way out because once Ashley and Leon are reunited, it's just going to get that much more harder for... Um, escorting and fighting. Thank you again for listening in and I hope you guys have a nice day. Goodbye.